Good morning, it's the final day of the Tour of Yorkshire this morning and I've woken up, I've been relieved of my duties this morning so I'm gonna go on a bike ride out to meet some friends in Otley and then ride out to the circuit to the first KOM point of the day, Park Rash. Better get going. Tell us, where are we going today, mate? Uh, we're going to Park Ratch, Rash to watch uh, the Tour of Yorkshire stage come through. Yo, are you Callum McLeod? <laughs> oh my God. Got fans all over the road here. So tell us about Park Rash, is it the place, place to be? Uh, place yeah, to I reckon, I reckon it's the place to watch today. I reckon it will split up quite nicely throughout there. It's going to be Carnage, Giles Pickford, I reckon, so. Carnage? Carnage, yeah. That's, that's what we like, innit? Yeah, we like a bit of action in the bike race. It's a Yorkshire. It's a Y for Yorkshire. I'm meeting with Harry Bros. <laughs> it's a Y for Visit Yorkshire. The, bit, the, the number one sponsor of this year's tour. Mate, you're doing the marketing for me. You know what I mean? Oh, you mean? Or is that <laughs> we gotta go down there for the cat. Can I make my own vlog? No, it's my channel. You get your own vlog. Yeah, I'm starting a channel called Bikes. No, I can't put that in. Oh, fuck. <laughs> What's it called? Um, B, 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 B on B. Yeah, B on B. Big boys on bikes. We're actually in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Been riding for two hours and we just found some houses. So basically, stop for just, some lunch. Yeah, we're just gonna like try find some food, but there's probably only like mud and plants, and I'm not getting anything because in these ends they definitely don't do contactless. So, <laughs> so we just stopped in a little town for a spot of lunch. The race has started about an hour ago, so we're absolutely smashing it up to the first KOM on the course today. It's about 10 minutes up here and we'll probably get there about 20 minutes before they arrive. There's a break of about six or seven who have a lead of about two minutes. So hopefully we'll be able to see them all as they go fast. There's no name for what you feel. So here we go, this is the famous part rash. I'm just coming down the valley here and I could already see a few hundred people up on this climb. Man, I think the uh, atmosphere when the bunch comes through in a bit, it's gonna be, it's gonna be pretty, pretty electric. Look at that. That is a, that is a climb and a half. Park rash. Mate. Yes, mate. What did you make of that climb? About to hit a 45% berg. <laughs> Look it, how many people are there. It's insane. Madness. They're not ready for this big ring smash. <laughs> like. If we see them up there, it's probably like... What are you uh, thinking, Joe? What do you reckon is going to happen? This climb, attack. We're going to come here like five miles an hour. <laughs> five miles an hour.
we just absolutely smashed it back from the common park crash and now we're back here in Otley waiting for them to come past by the time they get through here it'll be about 10k to go so it'll be all action at the front we're told there's a group of three riders with just over a minute on the main peloton on this climb there's so many people here it's awesome Well, I think today today was pretty cool. We get we got all the boxes ticked, didn't we? Really, I mean, yeah, it's like sick rollout. Saw the tour twice. Yeah, it's pretty cool. What more could you want? When we saw them, there was just three guys just off the front. It looked like they were going to catch them, definitely. But um, by the time this video is uploaded, you guys will know what happened on the stage. But um, it looked like they were going to be caught. That ride was pretty special. I mean, coming from down south, I can tell you these roads are pretty special. If you ever get the chance to come up here and ride around um, Harrogate and around there, it's, it's, it's absolutely stunning. It's definitely worth worth a visit. That's just... cool people as well. It's like most fun day I've I've had on a bike since Calpe, at least. Really? Yeah, like, yeah. It was one of those, it was, it was that feeling, wasn't it, where you did an hour before you even realized? Yeah, yeah. Just with cool people like ripping round lanes that can actually ride round lanes. It's just sick. Like Tom Peacock's dad. Yeah. Shout hitter. out. Yeah, like actual hitter. <laughs> <laughs> so what a stage. It was just after we saw the peloton there on that climb in Otley that the race absolutely kicked off at the front. And it was a very exciting uh, finish with uh, Greg Van Avermaet taking the stage and Chris Lawless from Team Ineos who took the overall. Um, unfortunately, our man Rob Scott, who started the day in the red jersey, couldn't quite hold on to it on the stage. Uh, he put up a fair fight, uh, but yeah, as I said, it was it was close, but uh, lost it on the day. What an absolutely great race. Once again, Tory Yorkshire have put on, and I cannot wait until September where the World Championships will be taking place on the very similar roads uh, to stage two, I think it was. But anyway, guys, if you have any questions about the race or any questions for me at all, please do ask and I'll reply to as many as I can in the comments below. Um, but for now, I'm absolutely knackered. It's been a, it's been a big weekend. Uh, I'm going to go back, have some sleep, recover. And then next weekend is the Lincoln GP, one of my favourite races on the calendar, um, the 64th edition. Um, so yeah, thanks guys for watching and I'll see you then. Ciao. Yeah.